We're here in Venice and the first thing we're gonna do is have a little toast with some Prosecco. And Alex is trying to open a little bottle. Are you ready for this? Ready? <laughs> Woo! Congratulations! <laughs> Huh? Pretty good. How much was it? Like We just purchased an umbrella because it started to rain, but now it just stopped stopped raining three minutes later. So we got an umbrella souvenir. Seems like we have a lot of cheap umbrellas from all over <laughs> our travels. So the easiest way to get from the cruise terminal into uh, Venice is to take this tram that we're on. It's only a Euro. It's the only down. It's the people mover. It only runs um, until 10 p.m. That's the only downside. But um, that's the way we tried to get in here, but we got sidetracked this morning. But if you take the people mover in, it's a Euro, and then once you get to the train station. You buy like a, basically a vaparero, it's like a, a bus ticket. They're the buses, they're like the water taxis that take you all over Venice. And you can buy a 24 hour pass for 20 euros and use that to go up and down the Grand Canal. And that's probably going to be your easiest and most affordable way to get around Venice for 24 hours. So. so. When you overnight in Venice, like we're doing, everybody stays aboard or ashore, which creates a very empty cruise ship. So we had an amazing day in Venice. I don't know if it was amazing. We were fucking lost for half the day. So most of it. I think at three quarters of the day, we walked into like two people's living rooms because we thought this alley was going into somewhere. And literally, this is what happened. This is me earlier today in Venice. We couldn't find anywhere to go. We were lost all day, and half the time I would walk down the canal, I would walk down an alley, and make a left, and I'd be like, "Oh, there's a brick wall here." <laughs> I've never been on a I've never been on a cruise ship or at an improv where a comedian has done so well one night and just completely fucking bombed the next night, and that's what happened. We had a guy from England who was hilarious. The first night he was so great. Everybody's laughing. Second night, it was like crickets. We had great expectations and we crashed hard. Yeah, and, he, and he, the only reason we came back that night is because he even said, don't worry, come back tomorrow night. I have I'm a lot of material. This. I've got, yeah, he's like, I got over, I've got hundreds and hundreds of hours of jokes. So I'm gonna have all fresh material to the next night. Yeah, it was like fresh material. It wasn't <laughs> fucking funny. <laughs> We came back to the boat to have dinner, and then we said, oh, we're going to go back into Venice and experience Venice at night, because tomorrow we leave at 6, so we won't be there late at night. Well, I think you don't have one of these. Huh? And Erica says, no, I'm kind of tired. I just want to go to bed. Hey, 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 I bet you don't have one of these, huh? 
ha ha, chala, I got all my drinks paid for by Carnival. Da, da, da. You don't have one. Yeah, but you know what that means? It just means you lose a lot of money at the casino. So, well, if you lose enough money, they're going to start feeling bad enough for you and buy you some drinks. Oh, they're starting to feel real bad about it. Yeah. So anyways, have you ever wondered what the uh, hallway of a cruise ship looks like? Well, there you go. So whenever we leave in the morning, the bed is messy. Erica leaves all her shit all over the floor in the bathroom. Just like she does at home, right? There's no, nothing changes. The difference, the difference here is that uh, twice a day, twice a day, someone comes into the cabin and cleans. They, they come in the morning to clean up everything, make the bed. <coughs> Excuse me. And then they come back in the evening to turn down the bed, and they leave you a little, a little chocolate, a little mint on your pillow, right? That's what you need, right? Because, because if there's one more thing you need on a cruise ship is more fucking food and candy and shit and everything else that you get on here. They say, well, we're just going to top it off with a couple little mints before you go to bed. And believe me, I like chocolate as much as anybody, as you can tell. But I'm making like a severe stack of uh, chocolates and mints over here because it's just getting ridiculous. There's just so much fucking food on this boat. When you're in Venice, you don't have cars, you don't have uh... There is no cars inside the city of Venice. You don't have cars, you don't have anything. You have boats, you have like, we saw an ambulance today, it was a boat. We saw uh, three police or four officers. police officers, they were in boats. Everything's in boats. Uh, we saw people delivering pizza. Uh, pizza. Domino's pizza had a boat. But yeah, a little Domino's pizza had a boat. <laughs> Really? No. Oh. We're just kidding. I, I thought you saw it. No. Well, there you never know. We're late. Right now it's uh, 6.40. We were supposed to be back on the boat at 6.30. We made it back. I told Erica just to relax. Like she was running, she left me behind, right? So we know if we get into a crisis, I'm just gonna be on the ground dying and she's gonna run off to safety. Gonna go drink our uh, champagne. Courtesy of John Hill. So we're pulling away from Ven Venice and apparently we left two people behind because they never showed up 7 10 and we were supposed to board at 6 30 we were running late and these people haven't even showed up it's crazy can't believe that happening happening to us and this is their view from the ship wow. nice came back to the room tonight we've got another towel animal here what is that a frog erica what do you think it is frog frog it looks kind of like you, no? Yes. Really? That's what happened to me when I fucking kissed you. <laughs> you kissed me and you turned into a frog? Yes. Come on, baila, baila, baila. No, so I had money, I was like, oh shit, I forgot my money. And Eric was like, dime, dime, dime. Dame, dame. Dame, dame some dineros. And I said, no, it's my dineros. I'm going to the casino later. See, I budget myself when I go on a cruise. You know, Erica just blows all her money the first two nights. I usually just go conservative and then I wait till the last couple nights and I think. Left on. Right on. Left on. Roll up. Roll down. 